Hey guys, so today I'm doing the much awaited video on how I started my locks uh, with a perm without cutting any hair off. So when, when I started my locks, um, let's see, uh, with my baby girl, she must have been about three, and I was wearing, uh, you know, box braid extensions, individuals, and um, over my permed hair so what I did was uh, I would wash my hair as usual with the braids in and uh, as my hair grew out um, instead of like taking the braids down and combing the hair out I would just let it lock and then um, when I had about an inch new growth when I redid the braids like I said I would not comb out the hair I would just put the, the new extension here over the the new growth like this like say this is like the fake hair and just you know box braid it in like that you know and then as that grew out when it grew out another inch and still washing as usual every week but when it grew out another inch I would do the same thing I would take the braids out but not comb out the hair that was locking and I would rebraid it so I did that over and over again over the course of I don't know maybe a year till it was long enough to stop putting in the box braids and then eventually I did cut off the perm ends when it was long enough at first I thought, oh, I would just keep them, you know. I thought, you know, maybe I could have that Lisa Bonet look where she has like the dreadlocks and it's like wavy at the end. No, it did not work for my 4C hair. Um, you have to have that wet and wavy hair to do that. But um, anyway, um, it was all good when my hair got long enough. Um, yeah, I just cut off the perm ends and just started, you know, um, retwisting my roots as usual and just start my dress like that so um, if you don't want to cut all your hair off if you have a perm you can start dreadlocks uh, without doing that so I hope this was helpful and if it was don't forget to like and subscribe and tick the bell so you get notified for new videos and if you have any questions or any topic you want me to cover uh, leave comments below. Alright, thanks. See you next time.